you are watching this, the Pat McGrath Holiday 2022 Celestial Nirvana Collection just launched and it took her a while to put up her prices and her bundles so that we could see what we're working with. So we're going to do a little bit of a kind of shop with me style, take a look at the bundles, sharing with you what I think I'm going to end up picking up. I will have the early access code slash discount code, which will save you 10% pinned in the comments if you want to check that out. But let's go ahead and check out the website now because we've only gotten the images that she's put on her Instagram. So we're going to have some new images to take a look at, the pricing we will be talking about, what I'm picking up, all of that good stuff. Let me know if you picked this collection up down below and let's get into it. So we are finally on the official page. She didn't reveal this or have this open until literally 24 hours before. So we can see all of, oh my gosh, look at that makeup look. Oh yeah, uh, see these are all images that we have not yet got to see. This looks stunning. Turn your holiday on, dare to be major in the otherworldly ornamentation of holiday 2022 with all new okay yeah <laughs> so here we are we finally have the prices so this is 82 dollars so the main palette is what i was curious about slowly but surely pat mcgrath has been adding extra money onto her products which she is not the only brand to do so but last year this palette was 78 dollars so she brought it up a big Four buckaroos. So we definitely have those inflation prices hit, but I would definitely be getting this. But I want to take a look at the bundles that we have. We also have all three of the new high volume tricolor mascaras for $85. Unless this is a bundle that seems worth it, I, I have no intentions of picking this up. I'm not a big fan of the Dark Star mascara. I mean, I, I do actually like it. That's a lie, but it does flake a little bit. I prefer the fetishized. But you can get this is an interesting bundle. The palette and the mascaras for $152. I don't know if... I guess that's a little bit of a deal, but do you need all the mascaras? Okay. And then each mascara individually is going to be $32. And let's see. Okay, here's the bundle. This is $102 for the... Is this the Eyecold? No, this is the Mixing Medium Glitter Glue, which is a decent product. Not one of my all-time favorites. And you can also get it with the palette. NYX Glitter Glue, in my opinion, works just as good, but... Have at it if you like it. Now, the Divine Blush and Glow cheek palettes are going to be $62 each. That is expensive. Um, so each individual blush is $39 each, which you get four blushes in here for $62 and a highlight that actually is a very good deal, though I don't know the size of the blushes. I'd imagine they were smaller, so that'll be interesting to see, but $62. I knew the highlight was going to be $60. It was last year, so there was no price increase on that. Divine Blush and Nude Venus 2 is $39. Same price as the individual prices as we currently know it. Sorry, I keep <laughs> running over the top. Uh, the Velvet Coal Eyeliner, $29. I have that, so I won't be picking this up. The lipsticks are on sale, I guess. <laughs> Okay, for $39, supposed to be $48. These lipsticks are $48. I'm not buying a lipstick. Oh, here's what I'm talking about. Then we have the Eye Quince for $36. I don't know how big or small these are going to be because $36 seems pretty good for Pat McGrath, you know, for a Quince. Huh. Okay, so that was very insightful. I don't know if she's going to add more bundles because this is not the bundles that I had envisioned, so maybe she'll add more on launch day potentially, which you would know now <laughs> when you're watching this. I thought there would be like an all-encompassing kind of bundle, so I'm surprised that there's not. So then I'm going to tell you at least what I'm going to pick up if bundles don't show up. So I'm definitely going to pick up the eyeshadow palette for $82. Let's take a look at the images because I haven't gotten to take a stroll through the website yet to see. Why is the packaging so pink? And then here's the names of all the shades. I love her website. I love how they do it. I feel like it's so informative and inspiring and it's very helpful to makeup reviewers and you get so many different images here. All of the swatches. 
And then I think all of these are videos you can see on Instagram. Ooh, this is such an inspiring look. That's gorgeous. I might want to create something like that in my review. And then it tells you here there's four different finishes. Gleaming metallics, mattes, shimmers, and satin frosts are the four formulas. So there's definitely not going to be any special shades in here. Okay, so that's it for the palette. So I'm happy to know that there are four different formulas and I just feel better knowing what formulas are in here. Are we gonna load? Okay. Let's look at the promo images for the mascara because this wasn't the highlight of the marketing, which is pretty obvious why. <laughs> yeah, I don't think many people are going to be into this, but... Okay. I mean, certain looks, you know? Ooh, the website's getting a little glitchy on me, so I'm struggling. And then, let's see, here's what the pink looks like. This lady has amazing lashes, oh my goodness. Yeah, these colors are not even like neutral colorful, they're like very vibrant. But have at it, I do like the packaging. Okay, I wanted to take a look at these cheek palettes, see what we're working with here. I feel like $62 is not a bad price, especially considering... The one highlight is $60, right? So I wonder how big slash small they are. How much is one of my blushes? Okay, so this is definitely gonna be small because overall my one blush is 9.7 grams and all of this is 20 grams of product. So this has about as much product as two of these blushes, which would be what? How much did we say these were? $39. So two blushes would be what? $78, whereas you get four different. I mean, it still actually is quite a good value, but I think that these are gonna be small. I wish we could see these kind of in comparison to the palette, like next to each other. So I don't know, but they, it does look like they're gonna be small based on the product that we have. Four petal soft blushes, demi matte and satin pearl finishes, blah, blah, blah. So this is Nude Venus. So this one has the warmer shades. And then here are the names of the colors. So Desert Orchid and Nude Venus are old and they exist. Sunset Nectar and Divine Rose 2, I believe, are the new ones. So that would be number, oh my gosh, this website is not good for scrolling for you guys. But number two and number four in the swatches should be new. And then the Sunset Nectar, I believe that is also new. And then in the Divine Rose, Desert Orchid 2 number one is new. Peony Rose number two is also new. Divine Rose one already exists. Electric Bloom. I'm not sure about that one. I think that one already exists. I just don't own it. And then Nude Nectar Highlight. These both look so stunning. So I'm definitely picking up both of these. And what did I decide on? The palette. The two blush palettes. Do I want the highlight and the blush? Is Nude Venus 2 in these? Hold on. So there's Nude Venus 1 in the blush palette, but not Nude Venus 2. Oh, come on, Pat. I actually think I might skip on this single blush. I can't tell you. It's going to be a surprise when my review comes, but I don't think I need the blush. I have already every other blush that exists, so I actually might save myself $40. And then the highlight, I don't need it since I'm already getting the blush quads, so this might be overwhelming. I... I love this formula though. I'm not gonna lie to you, but I actually think I'm gonna pass on this and the blush as well since I'm already going to get the two blush palettes. However, if and when Pat McGrath has a sale, then I think I'll come back to these because $60 is a lot for a highlight. And if the cheek palettes did not exist in this collection, I definitely would have picked up the individual highlight and the individual blush, but that's $100 right there, and I'm already getting both of the cheek palettes, so I just don't find it necessary, but when Pat McGrath has a sale, I think I'll circle back and pick those up. The lipsticks, if they're $48, absolutely not. $39, I think I'm going to pick up New Venus. So I think that's, oh, I, I almost forgot. These two Celestial Nirvana eyeshadows. Let's take a look into these, $36. I'm picking up both of these. So yeah, definitely not getting the two individual cheek colors. We're working through this together. This video is not meant to be informative. <laughs> this is a shop with me. Uh, so what do these say? Transcend the spectrum with a beautifully edited quintet, oh, quintet 
starring five celestial hues in three ultra smooth finishes. So there is sublime silk matte, shimmering foil, and a mesmerizing metallic. So I don't know that these are going to be the Blitz Astral shades because she didn't specify that. But glimmering metallics, some shimmers, and some mattes are the three formulas in here. But don't they look extra smooth? They really do. So this one is Bronze Bliss, which is... Mm, delicious. You guys have already seen this one. I mean, well, you've seen all of these photos already and the nude allure. Mm, mm, delicious. Picking up both. I did need confirmation that Blitz Astrals were not in these or if they were, but these look particularly beautiful. However, Pat McGrath be uh, photoshopping her photos and filtering them, so always take them with a grain of salt. But I'm definitely going to pick these up in case you want to see. I think that these might do really well for the people who don't want this super colorful big palette. I'd almost argue that these might sell out before the big palette because the big palette, as lovely as it is, it's very colorful. And I think for true like neutral lovers, they're going to be more drawn to these palettes right here. And it's $36 versus $82. It's much more palatable to pick up. So I think it's almost more important to pick up these instead of the big palette. And I don't think these are going to be around as long either. Mostly these quads, they don't last or stick around too long, particularly if it's a really good color. And both of these are really good colors. So I'm excited about these. I just feel like these are going to be very special in this collection. We'll see. I could be wrong. So here's my final order. I've officially decided. The big palette, both of the blush palettes... And we're going to finish off with both of the eye palettes. And I'm going to leave the lipstick and the two individuals for a potential sale. Because right now, that would save me, what, almost $140? Okay. And I think I got the important stuff that you guys want to see. At this point, I've already made my order, so you cannot change my mind. <laughs> but you guys know what to expect in terms of the review. Let me know your thoughts. I'm actually waiting right here to see the comparison of the blush palette to the big palette. Excuse me. That's a pretty look. I don't know. They don't look so small compared to, but it's kind of hard to see the way they cut it. Anyways, if you wanted to pick up this collection, it is now available. Make sure you use that discount code. And if it is before 10 a.m., make sure you use that as an access code to enter. I'm really excited. I had a fun little cruise around the website with you guys. If you have any questions or anything you want me to cover in the review, let me know down below. The only thing that I'm like, uh -uh, at least 24 hours beforehand, they don't have any bundles up. And I wanted like a big giant bundle. I probably sound really stupid if they have that up right now. But anyways, thanks so much for hanging out with me. Make sure you like and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you soon in the review. Bye guys, have a good one.